Hey, what's up, you guys? Thanks for coming back to join another episode of Get Vlogs. Welcome to the greatest hustle in the world. And we back in one, two, three, go! What up, what up, what up, what up, G-Fam? Can you turn it down a little bit, man? Appreciate you. As you can see, I'm in a house chilling. Another day, another dollar. I went through a hard day's work. Travel in this corona-filled world. God bless y'all. Y'all be safe out here. But getting back to things, I'm going to do things a little different today. I'm going to give you my inspirational word, then we're just going to talk a little bit. So my inspirational word is life don't stop, so why should you? Now, with that being said is, you know, there's a lot of things going on right now. As you can see, I got my ace bone cone right here. Hey, Joy. Yeah, she in the middle of a good meal. So, you know what I mean? Uh, it's it's a, it, Like I said, it's a lot going on. You know, you got to keep on moving because life don't stop. And with this being said, life don't stop. It's, all, it's a whole bunch of different things you could be doing out here. You feel me? Excuse me. I just had to get up. And I mean, I just... I'm going to stop rambling, but long story short, like, there's been a lot of things going on in this world, um, a lot of comments being made about Corona, a lot of videos, a lot of things being said or done, I'm just here to tell you, you know, I'm just proud of everybody that's staying motivated, for my performers and the artists out here that's doing that thing, performing concerts from home, big ups to you. You know what I mean? Because it take a lot to do that for free, knowing that you get paid eighty and ninety thousand dollars for it. So like I said, the grind don't stop. But now nah, man. That don't mean we should stop grinding either. Um one of the things I want to talk to you guys about is um, <clears throat> like I said, the grind don't stop, but I talked to you guys yet in yesterday's vlog about me making some motivational moves, some um, moves that can put me in a better place to help more people be inspiring to more people at work and off work or outside of work. And, you know, I took another step in the right direction, sat down, had a meeting with a couple of individuals to see Everything I need to do to get where I want to go to succeed. Because, you know, number one, who wants to rent all their life? Who wants one car? You know what I mean? We as individuals strive for the American dream. And I'm seeing that, you know, in order to get the American dream, you got to really put your effort forward. And, and putting that effort forward, that means... Sometimes it's a lot of things that you can't do that you want to do. It's a lot of saving that you have to do. Um, whether it be you a business owner, you got to make business minded decisions. Whether it be you an individual just trying to shave and make sure your, your lifestyle can continue as well as you want to make sure your children, you know, are looked out for when you hear or when you're not here as you pass on. Um, you want to make sure you got a 401k. The grind just don't stop. So, you know what I mean? I talked to a lot of people and one one person individual, you know, stuck out to me because it's my girl. She, you know, the woman I live next to, she said, you know, I won't kiss nobody ass to get where I got to go and succeed. And in my mind, I'm thinking, you know, I feel you with that. I mean, I feel you 100%, but I'm here to tell you, you know, it ain't necessarily kissing ass, but sometimes in corporate America to, to succeed, you got to, I mean, it's sad that it's like this. I'm not saying this is a good thing. I'm not, you know, endorsing this 100% at all, but... You know, one, number one, I'm a black man. 
But number two, you know, people perceive me because I do have tattoos. I may not look ideally like the man that's on TV, but, you know, sometimes I have to coddle egos and, you know, docile my nature and um, circumstances in order to get places where I got to go. It shouldn't be that way. But in order for me to achieve the goals that I want my son to live out or I want things to happen for my son as well as my daughter, I got to be willing to, you know, be who I am as a modified version. And it's sad, like, I'm never going to sit here and tell you to change who you are, but I'm, I'm going to be honest with you because we honest on this channel. It's grind, hustle, entrepreneur, and transition. You know, we transitioning to new people, but first of all, in order to transition, you got to be willing to admit the things that you've done. You got to be honest with yourself because lying ain't going to help you none. But, you know, I'm seeing, you know, we in a world where predominantly, you know, corporate America is not typically the same color skin as me. And I'm not saying, you know... That necessarily means white. That could be Indian, anybody. You know, people who have a certain level or achieved a certain level sometimes forget where they came from. And I mean, sometimes you got to be that down-to-earth guy that's willing to turn the other cheek and be willing to say, okay, it's just a joke or never mind it. But I also will say this. You got to make sure you have your integrity and held tight. You know, have your morals and values. Have these things to keep you held down and centered whenever you in the business or corporate America because these things will help you achieve where you got to go. Even with people out here doing YouTube and really getting into it, it's 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 this YouTube thing is a whole different beast. You need lawyers. You need people to tell you what you can and cannot do. It's always going to be somebody out here that's above you or telling you the proper way to do things. So, I mean, sometimes you can't bring that nigga mentality with you all the time. Sometimes you got to park your issues and feelings at the door, fam. And I'm here to tell you, you know, as I elevate, I'm starting to see these things and it's maturing me a lot because I don't always agree with the way things go. But I will say sometimes you got to check your feelings at the door when it comes to business, being business minded. Um, I'm not going to sit here and ramble with you guys all day, but I just wanted to share a little bit that was on my mind telling you about my let my journey to succeed and to become the man or transition into the man I want to be from both myself, my children, and my family, and my future wife. So, I thank you guys for listening. I appreciate y'all. I love y'all. Uh, and I'm going to leave you guys with a message. Like I said in the beginning, motivational. Um, life don't stop, so why should you, my nigga? You should keep it going, keep it grinding, stay business minded, keep hustling. And last but not least, my girl gonna hate this, but I'm getting ready to do it. We out of here, baby! All right, I love y'all. Hey, you guys, thanks for checking out another episode of Get Vlogs. I want you guys to know. Always love your loved ones. Reach out to those you haven't talked to. And just continue to grind and hustle. I love you guys. I really appreciate you guys. Like, subscribe, and comment. And always remember, we out of here, baby!